79 years ago, on June 6, 1944, the D-Day invasion of Normandy began. Before D-Day, the Allies carried out a deception operation that made the Germans believe that Pas de Calais was the primary target of the invasion, which led many German divisions away from Normandy. Under the command of General Dwight D. Eisenhower, two million troops from over 12 countries prepared to invade occupied France. The invasion began with an airborne assault of 18,000 paratroopers that sabotaged the German reinforcements. The amphibious invasion began at 6.30 a.m. with the British and Canadians landing at the Juno, Gold, and Sword beaches and the Americans landing at the Omaha and Utah beaches. Mines, barbed wire, and machine gun fire made it difficult for all, but the most intense fighting came from Omaha Beach, where strong German defenses and rocky cliffs made it particularly difficult. By nightfall, 175,000 troops, 50,000 vehicles were ashore, with the Allies suffering 10,000 casualties.